probably one of the biggest problems I face right now with this transformation to become completely independent is the fact that I don't really understand what I have to do. I don't really understand how the world works. I don't really understand money, you know, how saving works. I don't really understand, okay, calm down with the bipolar, you know, you know, don't don't go over fun, you know, don't keep spending, you know, I try to fill a void with spending money, you know, you don't have to buy stuff to fill a void, it's something I have to do, learn, but honestly, there's a lot of stuff I have to figure out, like how to have enough effort to get my diet in check, how to have enough effort to get exercise in check, you know, how to, you know, get in the mindset of cleaning my apartment every day, you know, that kind of thing. So, this is just stuff I have to learn to overcome autism. It's rough, you know, but I have to do it. You have to do it too if you have autism. There are two ways about it. You want to become, auto you want to become independent, you have to do it. It sucks. But, yeah, I'm starting to really understand and calm down and say exactly what goes on. It's got to be a process, though. It's about getting in the right mindset, and that mindset takes time. It takes a lot of failure before you gain success. Like right now, I'm finally just starting to take care of things right away. The biggest thing for me before I got to that was, you know, learning to pick stuff up on my own when no one was coming. Probably the first step to that, step before that was, you know, cleaning up when I knew someone was coming. Step before that was asking for help to clean up. Step before that was realizing it, that my apartment needed cleaning up. So honestly, there are a lot of steps that led up to me starting to put things away immediately. So if you have autism, there are gonna be a lot of steps, a lot of failures. You're probably gonna need support is become independent, but it's worth it to go through it. So, it's about adopting you know, the right mindset. It's the reality of the right of the right mindset, and that takes time, a lot of suffering, but it's definitely worth it. You have to put up with the failures. It's going to be a lot of failures before you gain successes. I mean, a lot of failures. It's got to suck. I have a lot of people saying you can't do it. You have a lot of people saying to give up, it's not worth it. But you know what? It is. It feels nicer. So, just letting you know that it's how you overcome autism one step at a time. And uh, yeah, it's a lot of failure. If I see any success whatsoever, it's a lot of small successes where you really start to see yourself get to anywhere near where you want to be.